Dad. Dad, no! Hey, Riley. I understand now might not be the best time, but we need to think about who's gonna lead the crew. You know, Scott's been- Not now, Thomas. Fine. I'm sorry, Riley. Thomas isn't usually this pushy. So now it's your turn to feed me all this crap I couldn't care less about. Don't you get it? All I want now is revenge. You've been my dad's right-hand man in the crew, Patrick. Always ensuring his safety. Look at where we are now. I wish it was you lying in that casket, not him! My graduation party's just around the corner. And I need someone to dance with. The funeral's about to start. What are you two dawdling for? He was like my father. We spend a lot of time together. It was very funny, and I remember once he told me, Mary, you're like my daughter. He was like my father. I'll always remember him. Forgive me, Sean. But sitting and pretending that everything is fine ain't gonna cut it. I just got hold of these photos snapped the day before Sean got killed. What were you arguing about with the boss, huh? Patrick, what did he tell you that made you so angry? Patrick, what is this? Riley, it's not what it looks like. Trust me. I got Riley's back now, you piece of trash. From now on, I will protect her from a scumbag like you. Come on, sweetie. Maybe we should take a break for now. I'm sorry. I should have been better at comforting you. But seeing you like this, it's hard not to cry myself. I think you're here to make me feel better. Since childhood. Even though you're technically a servant, you've always been like a sister to me. What do you think? Patrick really have killed my dad? What exactly happened that day? Show some damn respect in front of the boss's body and his daughter. I ain't no buying any of this shit. When I came here in the room, Sean was laid out and Patrick was the only person who stayed here. From my perspective, he's the killer. I don't know. Mr. Murphy trusted Patrick and Scott the most. I don't think they'd betray Mr. Murphy, especially Patrick. He had a crush on you for so many years. So, do you have any plans for the future? I... I haven't really thought about it. Right now, all I want is to avenge my dad. Maybe... Just maybe. Perhaps... Scott could protect you. And help you to find the killer. Scott, I can take care of you. We can make business together. And I make sure you'll rise to the top. How in the world could you be of any assistance to me when our crews have been arch enemies? Try me. I need you to take out Patrick. I can't get my hands dirty on this one. Don't rush it, boy. I need you to take it easy. Everything takes time.
I'm tired of waiting around. I'm gonna take everything from Sean, especially his daughter. I got it, so take it easy. Speaking of which, don't let Sean's daughter get under your skin. Have your fun with her for a couple of days and then toss her aside. Deliver on your promises and stay out of my business. Little bastard. You're going to have a rest. You're too weak right now to take out your enemies with your own hands. But I don't think Patrick is the killer. Look. When I was adopted by Mr. Murphy, I was a kid. Been hustling in the underworld ever since. And believe me. When I said that you're in some real danger right now. Am I? I'll protect you from now on. Don't trust anyone else. Just trust my feelings for you. I had a crush on you since forever. Just for now, I only ask you to believe in me. Let me help you get through this tough time. That's a bold proposition. What? Let me find Patrick. I'll have him in no time. Yeah, how can you be so sure he's the killer? You know what? Patrick is not even our first priority. With Mr. Murphy gone, all of a sudden, our crew is falling apart. In the underworld, if you don't have enough power, then let's look over revenge. My dad's reputation and strength were absolute in the Emerald Cartel. Who can replace him? You. Me. Us. I'm serious, Rally. Let's run this crew together. Who the fuck is this?! Uh, what are you doing here? Who let you in? I could ask you the same question. Who gave you the permission to enter Riley's bedroom? So, now... that I practically got control of the Emerald Cartel, you are coming here alone. Uh, are you looking to get yourself killed? Sean and Patrick have always been the best of friends. Yes, they argue, they disagree, but that's what family does. Scott, I want to talk to Patrick alone. If I remember correctly, I didn't agree to you coming into my room, did I? You trust me now, right? Have you figured out who the killer is yet? Actually, it's just speculation now. I've just stumbled upon a lead. I'm gonna go check it out myself. Would you like me to come with you? Today I realized something. I'm done with relying on men to solve my problems. We haven't found Riley yet. Did she mention anything about where she might be investigating, sir? Listen, Riley. If you want to go solo, that's cool. But you've never been one to ignore calls. It's risky. At least I need to know where you are. I'm really... The thing is, I'm really worried about you. If you can't take calls, at least you should text back. This 
these photos seem to be taken over here. Flex TV, an exciting world of trending dramas.